Good morning on day nine of my African adventure. Um, sun's just coming up over uh, over my left shoulder there, and uh, just showered. Uh, Got to eat breakfast still. I'm all packed up, uh, so Thriven is going to drive me to the airport, which is only about ten minutes away. Uh, it's nice and convenient, uh, and I'll be heading off to Cape Town. Wow, I uh, just came through security at the Durban airport. Took me probably less than three minutes from walking in the door um, to passing through security. Uh, they must have their metal detectors dialed up high because they didn't even uh, beep or register when I uh, went through with my 100-mile uh, belt buckle on. Um, even got through my uh, samosas that Steve made me this morning as a little snack to uh, keep me uh, satiated on the plane. Just got a text message from my couch surfing host. Um, he won't be able to host me till Sunday, so the next couple days might uh, find a, a hostel or uh, perhaps an Airbnb uh, to chill. And uh, he gave me some directions, so uh, I'm gonna take the city bus uh, in towards uh, the downtown. So I made it on the bus uh, to the city center and uh, just got dropped off here on Long Street. Uh, looks like a kind of a, a backpackers district, so I'm gonna check out a few hostels and stuff and hopefully find a place to stay for the next couple nights. So I found my accommodations for my first couple nights at uh, the Carnival Court Backpackers here on Long Street. Um, got room 21. Uh, it's a cute little room. I have the choice between a couple rooms and this one. Seemed pretty cool. So I got a little fireplace. Don't think I'll need it. Desk, bed, window, and a little sink. So I'm gonna unload my bag a little bit, lighten my load, and uh, change clothes and then I'll be out on the, the town for the rest of the day. Wow, there it is, Table Mountain. I'm still pretty well in the city, but I was uh, just huffing it up, up the street here. It took me about 20 minutes from where my hostel is to get to this view here. Um, the cable car, I think, is just around the corner. Let's see what else we got. We got the lion's head there, and then the lion's rump back there. I'm almost there. Um, I've been told to check out the Table Mountain because the weather's good today. It might not be for the next few days. Because um, I could turn that way and uh, try to summit uh, lion's head, but maybe I'll try and do that tomorrow. Uh, so Table Mountain today, still got a little bit of climbing to go. Um, up to the cable car entrance and eventually I'll end up right up there. I've got this great big hill and that's not even half of it. There's a free shuttle bus that goes up to the, the cable cars but I decided I'm going to do it under my own power so onwards I go. I've wandered off road Seem to have found a shortcut. It's kind of like the uh, gross grind, but table mountain version. So hopefully wind up up there in just a few minutes. Just saw some uh, scat on the trail and it reminded me I'm not in New Zealand. I'm in South Africa. 
they have things like, uh, I don't know, rhino's not gonna get me up here, but all sorts of large predators, so better be on the lookout. I'm almost there. So that's the lion's head, Signal Hill. There's a uh, center of Cape Town, the World Cup Stadium off there in the, the corner, in the bay. And above an island up there in the, the top left. And then uh, the best way is the end of uh, Table Mountain. All right, I think I got uh, beyond the, the main tourist. I came up with a whole busload of, uh, uh, I think there were Chinese tourists and then there was a bunch of American teenagers that were being quite loud and obnoxious. So now I've got the peace and quiet. Enjoy the view. Beyond the, there's no guardrail in this section, so I'm right on the edge. Um, this is quite an incredible view. See, this goes basically straight down from where I'm sitting. Um, it's a pretty substantial drop all the way down there. So I'm just going to take my time. Uh, do some more walking around up here and enjoy the view. So I'm uh, back near the, the cable car station at the top. Um, I'm going to take it down because uh, I don't think I have enough time to hike down uh, before dark. So um, just taking in a few more of the amazing views from up here. I'm sure I'll be back up. Um, maybe not this mountain, but somewhere around here in the next uh, few days. So um, that's about it from Table Mountain.